Welcome back, folks, to Open XCOM Final. <laughs> oh, jeez. Open XCOM Terror from the Deep. I am your host, Jay Stank, with a skeleton crew on the Triton. I'm not sure why that happened. Probably because uh, I didn't. Um... And there goes Sub Super. Probably because I didn't actually fill up the Sky Ranger like I or the Triton as I should have. And now I've suffered the consequences by getting sub super killed in the first turn. Thank you, Captain Robin. That was very good. There's gonna be no reloading here. I'm either gonna get this. I'm either going to finish this or die trying. Hopefully we won't uh, lose the Triton. Let's do some scouting. Oh, the map is over here. Captain Dake, he does see one, so we're going to see if we have another Magnum Blast grenade here. Commander Moriarty does have a Magnum Blast, so he's going to prime that and uh, step across. And then Commander Dioxine will pick that up. And chuck it that way, please. Bam. That's what I'm talking about. Definitely don't want to get smacked by a grenade here this early. That would be pretty, pretty awful. Lieutenant MYK0 is now dead. That's... that's a, whoa. Reaction fire there. Good shooting from Commander Luke. That was close. That was uh, a direct hit, but uh, no kill. Let's run Captain Robin over here, see if he can't take this guy out. Good shooting from the squad today. Very good shooting from the squad. Our brave Admiral, uh, Honorary Admiral Meridian will go that way while we scout with a skeleton crew. Commander Dark Sign is down. That is very sad. Here's a good sign. In good fashion, Meridian does have all the grenades. He's also an expert at using them. Good job. We should probably take cover. Man, they're trying to control us. This mission's going great. I have no idea what type of Aquanaut would do the controlling, or how to identify them as I had said earlier in uh, the previous video. Alright, so Commander Robin, nope. Hopefully we can set up some reaction fire over here, but um... We're gonna have Moriarty come back around. It looks like there's some damage back here, maybe, to the craft. I don't know. It would be nice if, um, if we could get, uh, get a hole in the back. That'd be great. Whoa! There is one over there. And great shooting. Love it. Okay, there is no hole in the craft, so we're going to have to do this the old-fashioned way. And bust through the uh, front door. Of course, as we know, the front door of the Terra from the Deep. Jeez, oh man, stop shooting. You are a lucky bastard. The guy's hiding there. 
That was a very bad shot. Good thing Meridian has a prime grenade in his hand. Not able to throw. What if you came... Not here. Would you be able to throw now? That is actually a yes. Meridian with the grenades. Very good. Okay, we got uh, some mind controlling going on. We also got to open this door. That is not a good sign. This way, probably should have primed a grenade and said, It looks like there's only like one guy left, maybe. Nobody. Okay, hide right there. And uh, we'll have this guy move up just a little bit. Okay, I saw the guy go around the corner, so uh, Captain Robin, can you please go over there and get him? There he is. I think we have enough. Do that. We got ourselves a first live alien. Whoa! And we also have someone else. Go and hide. So there are two in there. This is not boding well for Captain Robin, although he did uh, stun that alien. I'm going to leave the medals up to you guys. Um, if you want to nominate anyone for a medal, we'll put it up to a vote, and you might get a medal. Seventeen. Oh, you need twenty-three, son. Holy shit. Get the hell out of there. get you some, uh, um, what do you call it, covering fire, right, here, hopefully that you won't, uh, bite dust, no, okay, there he is, stun that, bam, that's two stuns right there, what we got, uh, uh, aquatoid squad leader, that is something we need. Plus we got these funny things, and that funny thing. I wonder what those are. I don't know. Actually I do know, but... Spoilers... Can't do that. Actually, holy shit, didn't realize. That is not the last alien. Holy shit. That means there's more aliens on this craft. That means there is more aliens on this craft. Please, Commander Moriarty, can you come around, please? Thank you. Whoa! Got another guy. Haha. -ha. We have the tactical advantage here. We will grab another live alien. That's not all of them. That's a technician. I'm not sure how useful a technician is. Oh! Oh man! That was bad. Oh, the alien sub has recovered because he killed himself. Did we still get any live aliens out of that? I am the accelerators, magnetic navigation, alien sub construction, uh, aquaplastics, and zerbite. Yes, we still got our live aliens, and everybody who is <laughs> uh, on that sub, I don't even know who survived out of those people. Captain Robin and Captain uh, Commander Moriarty have made ensign. So at least they survived, but we're going to have to check check who survived that horrible mission. That alien was suicidal, came out and uh, kicked, us, kicked us all in the ass. We have two original people left, Captain Robin and Commander Moriarty. Everyone else is dead, as we can see. So, time for some administration. Let's see here, we got to purchase recruit. One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, the main soldiers we can. And we can probably sell some stuff. We got a leader. We have a technician. We have aquaplastics, learning arrays, magnetic navigations. Probably don't need all of those. Aquatoid corpses we can sell. Zerbite will keep. Sonic pulsers keeping. 
and um, we have medikits, sell those. So, uh, let's see. No one wounded. Okay. But we need, do need to actually equip the submarine with people, because I forgot to do that. So we do need four more, and they're coming in soon. Okay, let's go. There's our four guys, and we'll equip the submarine. Equip, or actually Aquanaut naming, right? There we go. So we are at the true crisis. Then you will be Dr. O'Lira. Doctor. Uh, next we will have Yeti. Next we will have Battle Bunny. Oh, those people have ranks. So I gotta go back and do that. Aha, here we go. True Crisis, you are a CPO. I actually don't remember what that actually stands for. Dr. O'Lira, you will be a... We'll make you a lieutenant because you're a doctor. Yeti, you are a PO2, which is private first class, I think. No. No! It means something in Navy rank. I'm sure someone will look it up and let me know. Battle Bunny, a PO2. Damien Merender, you are not named. No. So we have one more person. We have PO2 Kikaskia. Okay. That's it. Yep. That's it. Uh, Memorial. That is it. Uh, probably going to do some editing there. And we're back. Okay, so basically I had to cut there, but we um, went ahead and um, did some administration. So I cut there. And now we have like 16 minutes. So we can still continue to uh, go on. Hopefully we won't get attacked. Okay, that's one attack. That's a monthly report. We did good. That's good. Awesome. We also got the Sonic Pulsar, which means that uh, that's excellent. Sonic Pulsar means that now we can defend ourselves against a base attack. Sonic Blaster Rifle. Good. We can now produce the Sonic Pulsars at, uh, for Fossil Observite, which we will not do. We did get money, which is good. So let's check the graphs. Check the graphs. Okay, let's see here. What we got? North Atlantic, high spikes, that's good that I'm here. South Atlantic, low spike, north, everything else is flat. Indian Ocean, looks like they got a big spike in Indian Ocean. Caribbean, okay, we're going to put the next base in the Indian Ocean, and we're going to do that right now. So, boy, you gotta really know your geography, don't you? Indian Ocean, okay. So we're gonna go ahead and build a new base. Uh, centered around the Indian Ocean, which is actually by an island. It should be, it should be an island up, up in here. I don't think it's in there in this game. But we will put one right there to cover all that coast. And we will name it the Indian Ocean base. I could rename it later, but that's okay. So put the airlock down here, build some facilities, just a sub pen, uh, a living quarters, and a wide array sonar for now. And then once one of these is done, we'll put a store here. We have enough, not enough for another base yet, although it probably would be a good idea to increase our coverage, but I don't want to spend all my money. 
We could purchase some more soldiers. We could purchase some more. Let's invest in some technicians because we need to make money. So we'll invest in um, about 20 technicians and 15 technicians. 15 of those and another five soldiers. Okay, so that's awesome. Okay, we got everybody named. We got more soldiers coming in, so you're gonna be getting names. And equip the submarine. Okay, we got some more people on the submarine. We can almost fit everybody. So, uh, not any armor, but equipment. We're gonna create inventory template. Doesn't have stuff. Get rid of some things. Okay, Master Empire, we ran out of guns for you, so why don't you take some more grenades? Gentleman Gamer also ran out of guns. Get some grenades on you. We have guns, we just don't have any good guns, really. Could give you that gun. You'd be terribly overweight, though, so we really can't give you that. So we'll just go ahead and uh, give you some of those. Load you up. True Crisis. Same thing. Man, I really need to get some guns. But, you know, if I give them any other gun, it's not going to be useful. Unless they can carry it. He can. So let's do that. And oh, tasers, yeah. Tasers are useful. Are very useful. Yeti, we'll give you the big one. How about that? I know you like carrying big stuff. Awesome. Med kits. Do we have a Dr. Rulira yet? Yes. Dr. Rolira has opted not to be a, um, a combat soldier, but wants to be a medic. So we will give him two med... He will be double fisting med kits. And have one throw, just in case. Good luck. We also have... Sonic Pulsers, which I do want to put on there. Because those will be useful. Give everybody a sonic pulser as well, so long as they are not over uh, about over encumbered. And we'll hopefully be upgrading people's weapons shortly. But until then, we just need to blast everything uh, under the sun. Okay, so we got a new base in the Indian Ocean set up. We also got our soldiers set up. We actually have a sky or a triton that's full. Our research is Sonic Blaster Rifles, which we have not gotten any more scientists quite yet. Construction Workshop complete, that means we can fit more scientists. And more people come in. We'll name those people later since I did a lot of administration already. And another base defense mission. So, when we get back, folks, another base defense mission. Uh, this time we have Sonic Pulsers, so maybe this time we'll actually survive. Um, so when we come back, folks, another base defense mission. Catch you later. Bye.